Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to my Robinhood portfolio. As you can see here, I have my Stash Invest app pulled up, and today I'd like to talk about some new ETFs that have been added to the application. If you guys remember from my prior videos, Stash Invest is a great way for new investors to get into the stock market. The application has a limited number of ETFs and one stock, that one stock being Berkshire Hathaway Class A stock, or excuse me, Class B stock. The Class A stock is literally $270,000. It has the Class B stock and also a number of ETFs that are all rebranded in the application. So for example, if we click on clean and green here, you can see if we go to the bottom here, I've uh, got a little bit of a holding in this. I have an all investment app portfolio that I've been following over a number of weeks. I'll be putting out another video tomorrow with regards to the overall portfolio and how each of the investment apps are doing in Stash Invest. Uh, but if we go to the overview here, Clean and Green is actually the ticker symbol ICLN, iShares Global Clean Energy ETF. So the application simply just rebrands some underlying ETFs as their own. Uh, you can see the top holdings here. If we scroll down here, the new stock or the new ETF I want to take a look at is Combat Carbon here. This is a new ETF that has been added to the Stash Invest application. If we uh, scroll down to the bottom, you can see the ticker symbol there, CRBN. This is an iShares MSCI ACWI low carbon target ETF. And I really like this ETF. You can see the top holdings here are some very, very good blue chip companies. Apple, Microsoft, Amazon, Facebook, Johnson & Johnson, JP Morgan Chase & Company, Alphabet Class C and Class A shares. That is the parent company of Google, Bank of America, some excellent underlying holdings here. I may even take a look at this in Robinhood. I do like this uh, ETF here, CRBN, a new one that has been added to the Stash Invest portfolio. And again, you can see up top, it is rebranded as Combat Carbon. So very, very cool new ETF added to the Stash Invest portfolio here. If we scroll over to the I want, you'll also see another one here in the middle, Real Estate Tycoon. If we click on that, we can see the underlying ticker is VNQ. This is a great Vanguard Real Estate Investment Trust ETF. Uh, Vanguard funds are great because they have very low costs, typically 0.04% or lower than that, which is unheard of for ETFs. Uh, we can see here the top holdings, uh, Well Tower Incorporated. I've had a, a stock held as an individual stock in Robinhood. Otherwise, the other ones don't know too much about but any Vanguard fund is a great fund. Uh, I do have a very large holding of VOO in my Vanguard account. Great, great company, uh, great set of funds, and very low-cost funds as well. So that is the second ETF that's been added to the Stash Invest portfolio, Real Estate Tycoon. If we go over to I Like, there's been one more added as well. Let's see if we can find this here. High Voltage. If you click on that here, you can see I do not have a holding in this as well. You can see the ticker symbol there, another great Vanguard fund, Vanguard Utilities ETF, VPU. You can see some of the top holdings here, sort of mid-cap companies here. Uh, this is not AT&T or Verizon, uh, which you would typically think of in the telecoms utility section. You can see here Duke Energy, Southern Company. I do have that in Robinhood that's been doing very, very well for the portfolio. American Electric Power, PG&E Corp. A lot of very cool and very good uh, utility companies here, but it's kind of a smaller cap uh, portfolio here. And again, you can see this has been rebranded as high voltage for the Stash Invest portfolio. So those are the three new ETFs that have been added to the portfolio. Again, in the middle here from the I like category, you can see high voltage. In the I want category, you can see in the middle real estate tycoon. In the I believe one, you can see in the middle combat carbon. So very very good funds here. Two of those are Vanguard funds. I love Vanguard funds because of the very low cost ratio they have on those funds. So just wanted to quickly pop into Stash Invest here, talk about the three new ETFs. Again, Combat Carbon, Real Estate Tycoon, and High Voltage. And out of these three here, I do like Combat Carbon. The underlying portfolio here is quite excellent. Apple, Microsoft, Amazon, Facebook, Johnson & Johnson, uh, JP Morgan, Chase & Company, Google, Alphabet, Class C and Class A stocks, as well as Bank of America. Very, very good holdings there. So I'm going to definitely be taking a look at this in Robinhood. Maybe even jump in and hold a few of these shares. Dividend yield is pretty good on the bottom there, 1.83%, which is good for an ETF. So definitely very, 
very nice that the application here is adding new stocks uh, to the portfolio. So yeah, just wanted to quickly talk about that. Again, three new ETFs in Stash Invest. And kind of with that, I'll end the video. As always, if you guys enjoy my videos, feel free to like, share, and subscribe. Definitely appreciate all the support on the channel. Uh, if you guys have any good video ideas, if you guys have any questions about this video or other videos, please leave it down below in the comment section. I'll do my best to get back to you as quickly as I can. So yeah, kind of with that, I'll end the video and we'll see you guys next time.